Listen, I haven't even started editing this vlog yet, but I just know it's going to be chaos. So, um, prepare for no structure or like, it's going to be a mess. Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name's Hadley and I just moved to Los Angeles and this is my series where I go through like moving. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get a better intro, I promise. Okay, y'all, it's the next day. It is 12.20, and I have yet to unload anything from my car. Don't have to go shopping. I have to do a lot of things. I'm gonna give you an empty room tour. Okay, I don't want to give away any, like, identifying information. This is how you get into the room. The outside. I'm gonna lock that. Okay. And then we have our little desk. Closet. See, I haven't brought anything in yet. Bed. I want to hang some stuff on this wall here because there's not any stuff on it yet. Um, closet. And then the bathroom. Bathroom. Very, very simple. And I'm going to get, I'm going to spruce it up some, someday. S somehow. I'm going to figure it out. <laughs> okay. So it's like an hour later and I have some oatmeal. It is from Trader Joe's. And then I added coconut milk and this like syrup. And I'm watching a league of their own. The new one. Okay, y'all. It's 3.31 and I just got off the phone with my friends from school. They had their second day of school today. I figured that it's time to actually do things with my life so I'm gonna bring all of this stuff in from my car and it's super hot outside wish me luck If you know, please comment below. They're suede boots. They're my favorite. Okay, so this is what we're working with now. All of this. I'm recording on my phone right now because my camera is uploading to my computer. I'm so sweaty. It took like 30 minutes. Okay, it's... 5.30 California time, which means it's 6.30, and the only thing I've eaten today is oatmeal, so I door dash something. Okay, I got a burrito from Sharky's. We're gonna see how it is. I didn't order chips, but they gave me chips. Solid. Let's try this burrito. Let me look what I got. I got the Fiesta burrito with no meat. That's really good. Okay, well, it's the end of the first day, first full day here. I wasn't as productive as I wanted to be. Like, I wanted to go to Target. I wanted to do, like, a walk. I wanted to do all of this stuff. But I got all of this stuff out of my car. It's okay to not have, like, a jam-packed day. Your first day somewhere. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello, everyone. Welcome to day two of... California life. I got a really late start. It is 1.59. I decided to take this morning to just like relax and chill out because I was still like really tired from the drive. But today we went to the post office to get a money order to pay my rent. Love that. And now we're gonna head out to Target to get some food, get some stuff I need for my room. So yeah, let's go. Thank 
here's the thing. I bought that bag a long time ago at a Dina Menzel concert in 2014 because I went to the concert and I was like, I need to buy something. So I bought the tote bag and then I never used it. But it's huge and it comes in handy. So Adina, I'm gonna start using your tote bag. I don't wanna like stay in my room all day. I wanna like go out and do things, but I don't really know too many people yet. So I'm just gonna walk around my neighborhood because it's nice outside. I figured let's take a little walk around the neighborhood. Hey y'all, it's the end of day two. I have to motivate myself to like go out and do things because like there's no one here telling me, hey, you have to do that. I don't have a job right now, so I have to figure that out. Like I've always had school and like three million jobs to go to and things to do. And right now I have nothing to do. Like my schedule is completely open. So I'm sitting out here to get a kind of change of scenery, get out of my room. I took a nap. So yeah, that's a, those are just my silly little nighttime thoughts. We're gonna do more things. Do more things. Those are my, that's my affirmation of the day. So I apparently didn't film an intro for this, but I went to a coffee shop and filled out some job applications. I went to a place called Priscilla's and it was actually really, really good. Hey everyone, this is my second full day of being here. Yeah, wait, third day? I think it's my third day. I'm losing track of time. It's my third day. And I'm sitting at the top of the West Hollywood Park. I climbed all of these stairs. And now I'm just taking a break, sitting here. It's a beautiful view and it was good exercise. I'm gonna get dinner down here in West Hollywood. So I'm at LACMA. I don't know if you can hear me. A lot of people are here just like they brought their own food and got a picnic. I didn't think about that. I think people just like come here and eat dinner on the regular, which is really Cool. I got fries from the LACMA cafe and then I'm going to go by the iconic lamppost and take some pictures. Maybe I'll insert them here. I'm here at the beach. I'm at Venice Beach and I paid for an hour of parking so I'm not here like for a full day. I'm still in my hiking clothes. Oh, I didn't catch you up. Oh, someone's trying to sell watermelon over there. This morning I went on a hike um, with a hiking group that I found on Facebook and then I went out to brunch with those girls and then because the hike was near the beach, I thought might as well just stop by the beach. You know, you're in LA. I didn't change into my swimsuit or anything so I kind of just went and stuck my feet in the water and all that. I should probably leave, go back to my car, because it's a long walk back to the parking, and I only have an hour. Hello, everyone. So today is the 29th of August. It's Monday, which means that at midnight tonight, it means it will be officially one week since I've been in LA. I need to catch you up on a lot. Sunday, yesterday, I went to a coffee shop in the morning. It's called the Underground. And I sat down and I did some job applications. My week has really just been sending a ton of job applications, really. And I hope you can hear me because there's a ton of cars going by. And then last night, I went to the Underground Theater's production of three different one acts. And the first one act was about the key to life. He like knelt down in front of me and was like, can you open your hand? Here's the key to life. And then I hung out with some people that I met there. We went to this weird bar. It was tropical themed, but it was also vegan food. So I had some vegan chorizo tacos. And then today, this morning, I went to Central Casting because I had an appointment. So I started my onboarding to do background work. Now I'm here at, it's called the Vegan Playground. Basically, it's just a bunch of food trucks, some vendors. I will say that my one week being here has been the most roller coaster 
experience of my life in terms of like emotions. When I first got here, I had like thoughts of like, I want to go home, I want to pack all my stuff and just drive home. And then I've had really good moments like meeting some new people and really connecting with them. I would say if you are new to a city and you have hiking in your new city, try and find like a hiking group because you know, when you're hiking, there's nothing to do but talk. And when you join a group specifically for that, you know, everyone's also looking for friends. To it was really nice to experience that. And again, like theater people are the most amazing people. That's why I love theater and why I majored in theater. That's another ways to meet people. Go to a theater show. And the one act, I forgot to say this, the one act, two of them were original and one of them was a pre-written story. Were amazing and like there's so much talent there. What was I saying? It's been a really hard week, but it's also been a Thank really awesome week. Like the jazz concert I went to, there was such joy in the air and, and the music was amazing and it was such an amazing like atmosphere to be around. So yeah, like there's definitely something special about Los Angeles. But you know, having moved out here with knowing next to no one and not having a job has been rough for sure. So we're just taking it one day at a time is I think gonna really get me through and I can't wait to see you in the next vlog so if you want to follow along on my journey in Los Angeles doing some fun things please subscribe please like this video if you haven't already I'll see you in the next one